For this first episode of Dino Wars, we are going to be playing a simple game of two on two. So two players, each of which is controlling two dinosaurs. All right, Esco, let's go ahead and see where we get to put our guys. Roll a d20. Highest gets to pick. I got an 18. Mm-hmm. And you got a five. Okay, I get to start. Um, I'm going to go on this side right here, uh, and I'm going to put one guy here with a wounds six. Make sure he touches the back. And this guy, I'm going to put him right here. And you can put your guys out now. There you go. Put your die there that has a six on it. Over on that side too. Okay. There you go. And put your put your dice there next to them, your, your wound markers. Okay, D20, the highest one gets to start the first turn. I got a one. Oh no. 19. Okay, Esco, you get to start. So, you can pick one of those guys and you can move them. You can't charge, you're too far away. But you can roll your D12. Okay. Okay, you can roll it first and then you can figure out where you want to go. Two inches. Okay, move him ahead two inches. All right, your other guy, you gonna move him too? Yep. Okay, roll your D12. Five inches, whoa, he gets to go even further. Okay, you're heading that way, huh? Take him coming up on the side. Ooh, ooh it's gonna be scary. Okay, it's my turn. Um, I'm gonna move this guy first, um, one inch. That was not good. Okay, second guy over here. I'm gonna move him four inches. That's not great either. No. We're gonna bring him right up here. Okay, that's the end of my turn. There's no combat. Go ahead, Esco, your turn. I'm going to move. Move again, okay. Six inches. Okay. That one right there, that guy. Ooh, you're coming up on the side of me. All right. Six inches. <laughs> That's okay. You could use this one too. That's just six. Okay, there you go. And this next guy, you're gonna move him too? Yeah. Okay, roll your D12. 10 inches, whoa, nice one. He's going that way. Perfect, okay. I'm gonna move him first. Uh, he's going to go 12 inches. Oh, okay, I'm going to take him. We're going to go out here. There's six. I'm going to bring him here right in the middle. 12. And then this guy, I'm going to move him four inches. We're going to have him come this direction here. Okay. And that's the end of my turn. Your turn. Are you going to charge with him or are you just going to move him? Okay. Four inches. You can move him four inches. Oh, you're coming around behind me. <clears throat> okay. All right. Mm -hmm. This guy, where's he gonna go? This way. Okay, sounds good. Twelve inches. All right. So he can move forward. You can way. you can turn him like this if you want. There you go, and then move him all the way over here. Okay, it's my turn. I think I'm going to try to charge with him onto him. I can't measure beforehand, so I don't know how far it is, but I need a big number. Oh, two. So I failed my charge. It means I have to move that direction. Um, this guy, I'm going to try and bring him around ten inches. All right. Um, I'm going to bring him. He's gonna go this way, six, and then four more, right there. And that will be my turn, I'm done. Your turn, Esco, what do you wanna do? Move. Do you wanna move? You wanna charge? You wanna charge with this charge. guy? Yeah. Which, on this guy or this guy? Yeah. Okay, let's see how much you roll. Six, measured out, measured out, measured out from the base. Do you get six inches? No. Um, almost. You got right here, close. Oh boy. This guy, what do you want to do with him? He's going to move. He's going to move? Okay. You can roll your d12. Four. Four inches? You're going to go around that way. Coming around behind me. Uh oh. Sneak attack. Uh oh. There you go. 
Okay, it's my turn. I'm going to charge here. Uh, and three inches, that gets me in. And then I'm gonna charge with this one too. On the same guy, 12 inches, no problem. Oh, So, when I charge, I get two attacks uh, for each of them and you get one to defend. So roll your defense dice. Let's see what I have to beat for this guy right here. Go ahead and roll that, see what you get. You me first, okay. Uh, I got a two 20s! Oh no, 20s means it's double wounds. Oh, it's a critical hit. So if you roll a 20, then we tie and we have to re-roll. 13, oh my goodness. So from this guy, that's two attacks and they're critical both of them. That's I down to four. Down to, f no, you're down to two. I did four wounds there. Now this guy's gonna come, same thing. He's charging, so he gets to attack. 15 and a 13, beat that. And a seven, no, so that's two hits that go. This guy, blah, dead. Oh man, that was crazy, because I rolled a 20. Okay, Esco, this guy's turn. He's going to move. You're gonna move, you're gonna run away? Okay, roll your 12. Three inches, where are you going? Oh, I'm going this way. This way? Up here. Up through the, through the trees? There you go, there's one, two, three, is right here. Okay. All right, my turn. Um, I'm going to, I'm gonna move both these guys. I'm not gonna charge yet. First guy is gonna go five inches. Uh, let's see here, I'm gonna move him this way. So I get him, I'm gonna try and cut you off there. This guy's gonna move as well. He's gonna go nine inches. Let's see, let's send him, we're gonna make you pick. Six, and then two, three, right here. Okay, it's your turn. Are you gonna charge, or are you gonna move? move. You're gonna move again. You're gonna try to run away from me. <gasps> Nine inches. Uh oh, where are you going? This way, probably. Uh oh, well, that was a good move. That means I won't be able to get you with that guy. Nine. Oh, all right. Okay, here's what I'm gonna do. This guy's gonna move, and this guy's gonna charge. I can't pre-measure, so I don't know how far it is, but this guy's gonna move first. Let's move him three inches. Let's go. One, two, three, okay. And this guy's gonna charge, here we go, I need to get in here. Seven inches, did I get it? There's six, uh oh, that's gonna be close. Just got it, oh, that was super close. Okay, I'm charging, so I get two attacks. I got a 20 again. Oh, no. I want to die. And a 17, you might. I will come down to four. Okay, let's see. Yep. A six, yep. So you lose two wounds. No, that one and three. So you lose three wounds because a 20 is a critical hit. So you're down to three. Are you going to run away or are you going to fight me? You're gonna run away? Okay, when you run away, I get an attack of opportunity. So I roll an eight. Can you beat an eight? Um, I bet you will. 10, okay, so you're able to run away without getting hit by me. And you wanna move, so roll your d12. 11 inches, whoa, are you going this way? Holy moly. Here, come on over here, you can measure. 11 inches, so that's everything all the way up to here. That was a really good move. Because that means I'm not going to be able to catch you. This guy's 11 inches away, so he's not going to be able to get you. Well, I'm going to try it. I uh, used on a three wounds. Let's put you back down to three. Okay, I'm, I'm going to move him first. This guy. Let's go far. 11 inches, cool. So he's going to go six here, and then I'm gonna go five more. I'm gonna go right here. Oh, I'm getting close though. You could charge me actually. That was maybe a bad move here. And then I'm gonna try and charge him. I need an 11 or a 12. A six, okay, so I failed my charge. It means I have to go directly towards you in the direction of my charge. There we go. All right, your turn, Esco. I'm going to move. Going to move, okay. Gonna keep running away. 
11 inches. Whoa. I thought I thought for sure you were going to charge me. You're going to run away? 11 inches. There we go. Okay. I'm going to move him, and I'm going to try to charge with him. First him, 5 inches. Okay. Whoops. He's going to go here. And this guy, I'm going to try to charge with him. Here we go. Roll my D12. Six inches. I failed. So I have to go directly towards you and stop there. Your turn, Esco. I think you should charge me. Yeah. You want to do it? Okay. Here you go. Because then you get two attacks. Oh, you got to roll your D12 for your movement. There you go. 11, you got it. Okay, two attacks. Here's my defense roll. I rolled a 14. Two attacks. Can you beat 14s? Almost. If you get 20s, I'm in trouble. Oh, 19 and a 12. So you got one wound on me. There we go. Okay. My turn, huh? I'm going to... I'm going to charge with this guy. He's going to stay in combat. I could pull him out of combat and charge. If you had another guy, I would do that. But I'm just going to do this. Six inches. Uh-oh. Oh, that's enough. All right, so he comes in. Okay. Um, let's start with this guy. He's got two attacks uh, because he charged. Two attacks, a 13 and a 1. Oh, man. Let's see what you get. Defense die, 9. So there's only one... One wound there, drops him down to two. And this guy is going to attack as well. An eight, can you beat an eight? Sixteen, oh, so it does nothing. What would you like to do now? You know, attack back or run? Run, okay. Well, then each of them gets an attack of opportunity. Let's start with this guy. Fourteen, can you beat that? No, he's down to one wound. This could be it, folks. This guy gets an attack of opportunity as well. A five. Can you beat a five? You can beat a five. Yeah. No. One. Oh, no. So he runs away, and as he's running away, rawr, this guy gets him. Oh, man, that was a hard game because I got those 20s right away, and that really made the game go to my favor. Should we play again? Yeah. Okay, let's go play and set it up and play another one. Well, there you have it, folks, our first game of Dino Wars. It went pretty quickly because I got rather lucky with my 20s there. Most games probably won't go that smoothly for one player. We're going to go ahead and give this another try, but thank you for joining us here for this battle report at Grey Army Gaming for the future of gaming. Basic Battles, favorite top games to kids.